Okay, so today we're going to be talking about QR codes, okay? So, what is a QR code? We've seen them before. These are the codes that we scan, right? And so this makes it super easy um, with our phones nowadays, right? So, on my phone, I have one right here, um, down on the bottom. I have a scan code. You'll see that, that square with the four um, little square pixelated things in it. Click on that. When that opens up, right, you scan the code. Takes folks directly to the website, okay, or wherever that's wherever you've designated it to go. Also, we can use our camera, okay? So if we go to our camera, camera option, with new phones, the camera option will automatically pick up. So do you see that? So it's asking us to open it up in Safari. Let's go ahead and open that up. Takes people exactly where you want them to go, okay? You may have something on your Instagram. Say you have an item on your Instagram that you want to sell. I have this wonderful little ornament that I created. I do memorial ornaments and I also do uh, like baby's first Christmas, uh, so on and so forth. And so if I wanted to take this item and uh, share it with people on a website like Facebook or something, I would share the link. But if you are physically in person with someone, um, if you're doing a pop-up shop, you can take that uh, a QR code like we saw. We can print this out and we can, excuse me, um, we can have people scan it to be able to take it to us. So if you see here up by my name, click on the three dots, copy link. We can take that link, okay? So the link's copied on our, on our keyboard. We can take that link and we can go to Safari. So let's go ahead and go to this QR code generator right here. As we can see here, there are many options for us to be able to choose from, right? We can have uh, scan codes to our Facebook, V cards, which are, um, those are our contacts and our phones, um, PDFs. Uh, you can also do this with like Google Docs, right? And so we're using a URL from our uh, from my Instagram. So let's go ahead and paste that, okay? Generate. And there is my code, okay? I have different options. I can put a frame around it that says scan me. I can change this from squares to dots. I would uh, personally recommend using the dots. Phones are more likely to pick up that pixelated dot than the squares, especially if you are printing the ink can bleed and it's a lot easier for uh, the phones to read it if it is in the dot uh, version in my experience and then once you look down here you can see you can uh, download this in two different options i would always recommend downloading it into the vector uh, because vectors are scalable so if you were to make this code an inch big if you were to make it 10 inches big it's going to be readable and it's not going to um, distort the dots or distort the image in any way and so i hope this uh, was helpful again you can do this with your instagram you can do this with uh, contacts you can do this with your facebook you can uh, directly um, link it to paypal you can do your cash app code like this and so if you guys have any questions let me know and i hope that you found this short tutorial helpful